this is the second time now that I've started a video recently in front of this building. Well, technically it's the back of this building. This is uh, my favorite place to go. It is Wawa, but why I'm here today is my wife asked me to go pick her up some of these things. And these are 20 ounce, I'm gonna stress the 20 ounce, Coke Zero. She's addicted to this stuff. It's like me with coffee. Now I always ask her, why can't you just get the cans? And her logic is, well, it tastes different compared to 12 ounce cans. And it's gotta be the 20 ounce bottle of Coke Zero. The problem is, now first, I agree with her because I'm a beer drinker. And beer in cans taste different than beer in bottles. Uh, beer in bottles taste better. That's always my opinion. I, uh, I'm gonna stick by it. So I get her logic behind that. The only problem is the difference in price between beer and bottles and the difference between beer and bottles and beer and cans is not that substantial. This, you know how much this costs? Almost a buck 75. And when they're on sale, they're like a buck 50. But you can go to a grocery store and get like a 12 pack of Coke Zero 12 ounce for like three bucks buck 75 for this so if you do the math this ends up being a little bit more cost prohibitive but she's my wife so i'm gonna make her happy oh look closing time great song oh here's a tip i learned this um a couple weeks ago i was listening to this song uh, by the way i use spotify when i'm on my bike i love spotify i mean there's a bunch of different services out there but i've been very happy with them so i use it through my bluetooth see right there anyway if you listen to this song with headphones i did not know this the beginning of the song with the piano, it's only on the right channel and the guitar is only on the left. It's a really cool feature. So if you get this, pull up closing time, put on some headphones, and then you'll be in bliss. Ah, oh, I forgot to tuck in the strings. That's a pain. Are they tucked in? Uh, Reach yeah. around and tuck them in. They're tucked. They're tucked? Yeah. Look at that. It's funny. I like. There's a couple people that watch my videos, Hannah. That yeah. Are, are really annoyed when that happens. When like, your strings go flying. You know, the strings are every, and I don't blame them because it is. Really I'd be annoying. annoyed too. Exactly. So I always make it a point that when I'm like filming something, I gotta tuck in my damn strings. Hey everyone, it's Colin. Got my daughter on the back of the bike with me today. Did, uh, I don't know, how many miles did we go today? We didn't go a ton of miles. We just rode around locally. I think we did like probably 50 or 60 tops. Stopped in the dealership, let her look at some bikes. Did some good all around riding. It's almost 80 degrees today. It's perfect weather for riding. So we had to get out on the bike and enjoy it. So I've got my daughter actually on comms today. So say hello. Hello. So I'm going to ask you, what do you enjoy most about riding? Um, how free you feel when you're just like on the road, like you aren't enclosed in like a car, you're just free, you feel the wind, and I don't know, I just feel more free when you're on a bike. God, you sound like a commercial. Uh, I'm going to take that as a compliment. I guess it is. Now, uh, just so everybody knows, uh, she just turned 17. And she's looking to get her uh, her first bike in about a year, year and a half. So I'll, as much as I can, I like taking her on the bike with me, and she enjoys it. So I got her a pair of boots today, so she's excited about that. But we wanted just to drop in and uh, talk about uh, what a wonderful day it was. So, I mean, and essentially, I asked her that because I've asked her that before. I'm like, why do you like riding with Dad so much? And, I mean, do you really have a good answer besides just being free? I mean, why do you like riding with me so much? Um, you're the only one I know that rides, okay. so there's that, but <laughs> you're also a really good driver, like, you have fun with it, you like to take me places and show me around, I feel like I can see the world in a different view when I'm on a bike, because, like, I can look around when I'm on the back, and see everything, like, not through glass, see it through some plastic, because I'm wearing a visor, a full <laughs> face, but... Overall, I can just see and like feel everything differently. That's cool. You got to get the terms down though, right? So you don't drive anymore. You ride. I ride. You got to say you ride. We'll forgive you though. You're still learning. So I mean, I'm very, very blessed that you've been along for the ride as you've been growing up. And one day you're going to have your own bike. And then look, then we can like uh, do literally dual vlogs, even though I know you don't have a YouTube channel. 
Like you could be on another bike and we could talk to each other. What do you think about that? I'd be pretty cool, but I might steal the show. Oh, there you go. All right, guys. Now get out there and ride. Be well. And I'll talk to you guys soon. You got any uh, words of, uh, you want to say anything before we leave there, Gover? Um, you ride get... safe. Wear the right clothing, as my dad will always tell me. And we'll talk to you soon. No, that's not bad. That's not bad. <laughs> okay, mine was better. Don't be jealous. All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs>